Gina gets schooled on some super speakers that are made in Vermont. This is a tweeter, and it's almost set up like a microphone in reverse. And in place. Our concerns are safety, of course. We don't think we're going to have accidents because as people... A little while ago, and all... And replace that. The Cuomo admin reported stolen a tractor and trailer part. The game camera, which had been set up to catch thieves, snapped this photo you see allegedly showing Fairfield resident Adam Wagner and Dennis Charland using an ATV to steal that trailer on making sound waves in the Northeast Kingdom. A lot of it's science and a lot of it is just knowing what it's right. And, and maybe half the grace would be gone. How did this cat and its owner get stuck in a tree? Plus, Gina introduces us to a man making sound waves in the Northeast Kingdom. A lot of it's science, and a lot of it is just knowing when it's right. On average, uh, sexual activity leads us to do about the same amount of exertion as climbing a couple of flights of stairs. Plus, from Hollywood to the hills of the Green Mountains in Vermont, Gina gets a show she won't forget thanks to a product that's made in Vermont. So what does this do? That's the high notes, the high, the details, the symbolists, the ads, the ads, you know, the symbol work. And a Vermont nonprofit is on a mission to save a rare breed of horse. And an engineered in Norway, our recliners and relaxers are on sale now. Less expensive and more comfortable than Eckerness, our Mustang recliner starting at $9.99 is a great buy. The Burlington Furniture Company, 3D8 Pine Street, Burlington. Sponsored by Blue Cross Blue Shield of Vermont. Change can be scary, especially when it involves something as important as health care. But when it comes to safeguarding your family's health through all of life's changes, Blue Cross and Blue Shield of Vermont delivers the security and stability that comes from nearly 70 years of providing quality coverage. Our team has a passionate commitment to serving Vermonters. Our card assures access to care whether you are close to home or far away, wherever life takes you. Still, we are right here in Vermont to answer your questions and work to make our state a healthier place to live. Change can be scary, but choosing your family's health coverage doesn't have to be. With all of the extraordinary changes in health care today, one thing remains very certain. We'll see you through. Whether you're a stereo novice or an average listener, the right speakers are paramount to good quality sound. Gina Bullard found one man whose made in Vermont speakers are hitting the right note. Sandville has tinkered with things for his entire life. He grew up on this dirt road in Westfield, a farm boy who wanted to design cars. He headed to college in California. I was shy, a farmer kid, way out of my element as far as social, you know, from farm to Los Angeles. He never designed cars, but he does design something a little more boxy. <laughs> He custom builds speakers for his business, Sandville Sound Systems. This is a tweeter, and it's almost set up like a microphone in reverse. But I've never seen a speaker with, like, another mini speaker on top. <laughs> so yeah. wh why do that? Why? Well, it's to uh, eliminate any diffractive effects around the, around the speaker. There's no bounce for the sound, so it tends to radiate around the speaker itself. Sandville has had a lifelong love affair with sound. As a kid, he was intrigued by speakers, always rewiring and perfecting any sound systems he came across. In his 30s, he was selling speakers at a music store when he realized he could produce something better. You're shaking the birdhouses. <laughs> he doesn't make the electronics, but he has come up with the perfect formula. You hear the cymbal work sound quite real. To create 
what he calls accurate sound. His speakers are used for everything from listening to music outside Wow. To making the home theater experience feel out of this world. He's been in business 18 years and has created more than 1,000 speakers. What makes your speakers better than something you would find at a box store? Well, uh, I have the advantage of going into the house and... And I know when I walk into a room what its acoustic properties are. Custom installation is part of the package. And the uh, position of the speaker is 70% of the battle for the sound presentation. You can hear the actual subwoofers in the front. Yeah. Made in Vermont speakers that range in price from $800 to thousands. Ladies and gentlemen, Secretary of Defense. Powerful Hollywood sounds coming from the hills of the Northeast Kingdom. Gina Buller, Channel 3 News. Most of Sandville's customers are in Vermont, but many are also from Boston and Florida. You can find more information about his business at our info center, WCAX.com. Well, a part of our history is being preserved.